Now, this podcast, Jack, that can be downloaded from too. Yeah, well, you need listening. to discuss that with Jenny. Yeah. Because she's the one who knows about that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The what? family court's given my little boy... Oh, hurry up. I forgot my... Um, Constitutional Marshall's badge. You haven't got one on yet, have you? The family court's given my little boy separation anxiety. Oh. From me? Why? Oh, because he's been separated from mummy for too long and now he's back. Yeah. And he doesn't he thinks I'm gonna go. Right. Because we've finally got him back. Ah. Yeah. She had parenting, just work it out somehow. But I should be grateful, I mean Okay, so the put, us, been pretty good to me. put us on, Jenny. Yeah, I'm waiting. Yep. Waiting. Oh, wait, here we go. Can you people stop sending me fucking notifications? Oh, this is so annoying. Oh, fuck off my heart radio. <laughs> That's right. Mind the I, I know. <laughs> the wiggles on iHeartRadio, bro. <laughs> okay. Hold on, I've got the camera on me. Are we on? Are we? No. Now we're the first go live again. Two, one. Hello! Hi, how's it going? Um, I just wanted to take this opportunity to apologise for the poor internet connection. But hey, I don't pay for it, so. It's on? All good. Is it happening? Yeah, we're yeah. here. Hey guys, um, so today is our show from the fringes, and there's one, two, three, four, five people in a studio. Yep, so we need our own Kaitiaki Army, Home Guard, training. Sovereigns and uh, self-determined individuals. New Zealand is a violent country. There should be consequences with ram raiding and hammers, hammers used and stealing. With government crackdown on the crime, police have been um, stepped up on the beat. They're going to put police on the beat. So we know that this is a band-aid. The real problem is with families. There's no love with children, no respect or discipline. It all starts in the home. Also, um, Steve Evans from Australia uh, has been working with lawyers. He claims there's no justice in New Zealand. The state rules with no faith in the police. A civil war is brewing. And we've got John... Wanoa. Okay, here today. John will be talking to us about who we really are as sovereigns in this nation. The sovereignty of the chieftainship. And you may be wondering why I'm wearing this crown. Yeah, Crown Judicial Council. Okay, that's why I'm wearing it because you look good, baby. The People's Court in Huntley will have a home guard and a resting group, a posse, which will be going out and putting claims on people who serving documents, serving documents on people. Okay, individuals will earn their crowns growing from infants or idiots, gaining their independence from corporations. Identifying with the Royal Crown Council. Mm -hmm. Okay, because mm -hmm. we all know the birth certificate is a bit of a con. The passport has a child's ID photo on it and it's split in half for a million dollars in gold currency on it. Apparently, 500,000 goes to pay if you get into a criminal activity. What about the other? Five hundred thousand. I don't know a lot about that. They haven't done the equation. Yeah. Dean's here today, guys. Yep. And so what are you going to be talking about today? I'm just going to bring up a bit about the Bible, Jack, and talk about fools for Christ and foolishness. And I did a Google search, we'll talk about that, and I'll read out some Bible verses. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And our free counselling line for lost boys, men's line, 0508 Helen and the funny girls must go. Helen Clark supporting um, the, another pandemic. 
Yep, she was on TV. This what time. is she supporting, Jeb? Yeah. Jebbing. Yeah. She used to be. Uh, and her uh, used to be. The auntie, courage. Like I loved Helen. I yeah. think maybe half of the country loved Helen. Don't talk what to do our reckon? leader about that. What do you reckon? Did it half of the country love? Helen Clark? Mm. Oh, she didn't get as many death threats as Jacinda, I suppose. Yeah, I don't even know why the death threats <laughs> were so high with Jab Cinder. Yeah, Because yeah. of COVID. Yeah, but, like, she only did, like, one thing wrong. Well. Mm. Oh, we're almost on the The mindset out there, they've got to mind about okay, something. Guys, I just want to tell you, I'm a bit sick today. The Courage to be a Man, More Males in Early Childhood Education, Maracopa Man, Prison Children, ideas and values and that are the those of the hosts. It includes regular mentions of conspiracy theories for which there is little or no credible evidence. We recommend listeners consult a range of credible sources. Yeah, good morning. This is From the Fringes, the program about alternative provocative views. My name is Jack Geelan. We're Vox Populi, Vox Deo, the voice of the people. Now, Prince William is doing the daddy dance uh, with Taylor Swift. He's moving like this. Wait uh, a minute, can you expand? Well, on the daddy dance. Yes. You know, dads, Prince William. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, well, at one of her concerts, Concerts, yeah. The Julian, daddy dance. Yeah. Julian Assange is a hero of free speech because he's being set free. Do you yeah. know what? I always thought he was really cool. Yeah. He had a child in captivity, didn't he? Yeah. He's a wonderful character. Character, And we support free speech, but these are our own opinions. And Helen Clark is supporting the idea of the next pandemic. Do you really want to vote for her again? Oh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we need our own Kaitiaki army, home guard, and we need to train sovereigns and self-determined individuals. And we have John Wanoa, Wanoa here mm -hmm. to talk about that today. New Zealand is a violent country. There should be consequences for ram raiding and they're using hammers when they steal or break into shops now. With government crackdown on crime, reintroducing of military training boot camps, police on the beat. I'd like to see the, the police on the beat, you know, talking to people. What kind of beat? Well, you know, walking the streets. Okay. In our cities. Well, as long as that doesn't entail brutality. Yeah, but. Controversy, I'm happy. The real issue. Cameras on cops. Jack, they did it in America, it works. You get less police crime. Body yeah. cam. Well, if you ask a policeman. Yeah the right questions, yeah. then you will establish is he acting lawfully or is he acting legally? Now, we know with all the crime that's going on, it goes back to childhood, how the child is being raised. If there's no love, no respect, no discipline, the children will get out of control, won't they? Yes. That's right. Mm. Now, Steve Evans is in Australia working with lawyers as there's no justice in New Zealand, he claims. The state rules with no faith in the police. A civil war is brewing. Steve believes in shared parenting. So um, this idea of a civil war, John, what, what do you think when the, the sovereignty of the people is taken away and uh, they don't recognise the, the sovereignty of the chieftainship anymore? Do you think there's going to be an uprising from the people where they don't recognise treaty rights as at Matariki? last week and talking to a Maori person there and he was saying there's no equality with the treaty and the Maoris feel they're on the bottom so what do you think needs to happen John? Okay <clears throat> first of all I'll introduce myself as John Wanoa from East Cape that's yep. Ngāti Pro area and I'm up in uh, Ngāpui been there for years for sorting and solving the problem of yep. Maori and uh, and the rest of New Zealand, who's who, who's got the title to the land, the yep. native land. Yep. And I'm here for the native land title yep. to Britain direct. Yep. And the government in Wellington is the little crown. 
yep. and you've got your crown which is in the right place on your head yep. as you are the crown now because the British crown has abandoned us, yep. abandoned all the native countries oh. and gone into Germany, Frankfurt with all the stolen gold and all the stolen money and your birth certificates have gone there. That's where I'm at. Mm. <coughs> and who is running that? Carl Schwab is the leader of the World Economic Forum oh, that's know. leading the pandemic. Yeah. <coughs> and he's ran away now. They're all running away with, like, just in the door and do the damage yeah. and run because right. they know. Hey, hey, can I just mm -hmm. Ask me anything. Kia ora matua. Yeah. <laughs> Kia ora. Yeah. So with the Royal Royal Crown Council, <coughs> yes. there's a false crown, Yep. and there's a true crown. Yes, that's correct. I'm and, here. And yep. the People's Court um, in Hutley will have a home guard <coughs> and a resting group of people, like the, they'll act like a posse, will be set up with the ordinances of the court, also involving land title non-residential citizens. Individuals will earn their crowns growing from infants and idiots, gain, gaining their independence from the corporations, identifying with the Royal Crown Council, Judiciary and Common Law as constitutional marshals. Where's your sheriff's badge today, Dean? Uh, well, I left it at home. Yeah, we, we are constitutional marshals. We yes. stand for the rights of the people. And the Royal Crown Council. The birth certificate and passport has an ID photo on it, but it's split in half with a million dollars in gold currency given to each child. Half a million goes if you get involved in crime, and the other half a million dollars is what you're worth in security bonds. That's is that right, right Dan? Bond generate, that's right. Yeah, yeah. So generate. this involves admiralty law, you know, uh, the passport being in dock, and this sort of thing. Yeah. So there's a false understanding mm. of Admiralty law, yes. which honours the Crown, yes. but not the people, yes. Yes. not people's rights, right. yes. not constitutional marshals. Yes. So, um, yeah, Bay Corp challenged through cease and desist <coughs> notices, rates demand uh, by Andrew Hudson, I think his name, has no jurisdiction as serving a corporation. The council is borrowing from an overseas uh, corporations. Corporations dictate to us bestowing personhood in nautical terms, in dock, passport, uh, seaway roads. Yes. So this is a huge problem because yes. people feel they have to pay the rates. But who, where's, the, where's the money going to? Dean, where's the money going? It goes to the International Monetary Fund. It goes to the International Monetary Fund. And paying off a debt they have created, because apparently with paper money, you can create more money for yourself. That's right. And it becomes fraudulent, it's doesn't it? It's called fractional reserve banking. It's called fractional reserve, reserve banking. banking. Yeah. So we have a protest that's happening tomorrow. You're all invited, you, Jenny and Jeff down outside the, the council, stop Hamilton Council, council's planned rates increases. Join Ooh. the protest. Can I bring Kenny Papa? Yes, you can bring Kenny Sweet, Papa along. The rate payers are pay demanding rates. a public audit. Boycott the rates. A vote of no confidence in the council. Would Jesus <coughs> drive out the money changes from the temple? Yes. Most definitely. So, what do you think of all this, John? I think it's you're right on the button. Yeah. You're right on the money because that's where I'm at. The corporate's money, and they're turning into bitcoins and crypto now. They make yeah. the politicians. If you look, Chris Luxton is leading it off with four hundred dollars to buy into their crypto new oh. digital money, and I'm on that. I'm so chasing is that them up. real money? Is that real gold currency? Is He's that's, using the people's money to that's, go rich himself. Yeah. That's to replace the feared fake money. Yeah. They're yeah. going on to another fake money and they're going to snap all the crypto and demolish them. That's what I'm following it's right now. When you put a bowl of lollies in front of kindergarten children, Jack, the New Zealand government's lost an estimated $400 billion in the international stock market yeah. in the last 30 years alone. Yeah. Right. That's why ICC doesn't pay out. That's why the, the retirement fund went broke at one stage. There was nothing in it. Yeah. 
Because now, Ke Kerry Bevan, he's our leader of the Republic of New Zealand Party. Apparently, he's got a couple of broken <coughs> ribs, unfortunately. But he used to talk about the inner warrior. Men's retreat presents the courage to be a man. Pink tinged, pussy whipped, androgynous apologies for men. <laughs> oh, but honey, I don't think you That's can. That's a bit extreme. I isn't don't it? think you can say that on air, but I guess it's true to life. Yeah, That's well, there's real men, isn't there? Like, you know, uh, standing up for a man, to, uh, the courage to be a man. Yeah. The art of being a warrior is the only way to balance the terror of being a man with the wonder of being a man. So, you know, we challenge men in our society. Men are being charged for everything, aren't they, basically? And, and we do uh, it in a peaceful manner. But this morning on the AM show, they talked about more males in early ch childhood education. You don't see many males in schools now there being teachers. eight New Zealand male midwives as of 2017, Is there? I believe. Yes. And Maracopa man steals children because he's fighting out. He's gone off the grid, apparently. Mm. Um, what's his name? Oh, the, the man who abducted the, his own three children. His, his own three children, Fulham. yeah. Because he wasn't given custody. With shared parenting, we know that both mum and dad have input into the up. But if you're going to steal the child off the father, there's, there's, there's going to be consequences. There's a few arguments about this, yes. okay? And one of the theories... I don't mind arguments. One I'm of the sure. theories is, is that the courts and judges recognise that the mother has a stronger maternal bond, especially for the first five years. Yeah, but you can't deny the father, Jim. I know. A child needs a father. My son needs me as a dad. A lot of dads have been If we want to go into, excluded. do I believe that the uh, family court system is just? Yeah. That's a whole different conversation. Yeah. yeah. But I do, I do worry about men's mental health yeah. when they are going through the FC. So a mature man is an inner warrior. He realises that the major battles in his life will be fought and resolved within himself. A mature man is someone who has the courage to know himself. So men need to know themselves. We need the warriors to step forward. Forward, if we're going to have the kaitiaki guardians and our own home guard, we need to train men to be men, don't we? Yes. In our uh, society. Mm -hmm. And another factor relating to children is oranga tamariki, social concern, no funding for children. No, they're cutting back on social service providers with Oranga Tamariki, and they're not going to get the funding anymore. Well, so we have protested against Oranga Tamariki, haven't we? I've, I've had one encounter with a social worker. Yeah. Um, and I don't know that she was any less scared than the rest of the staff I've ever met from Oranga Tamariki. Yeah. She seems scared, and she seems scared of the hierarchy. Yeah. I don't know. Just a personal opinion. Yeah, well, it's Families for Justice. We've protested about their trafficking in children and not being there for children and this sort of thing, and they've been held accountable. You know that, don't you? Yeah. Many a time it was Steve Evans. And I personally, I'm not condoning all the injustice that has happened from OT. Yeah. But I personally have not had a bad encounter with an OT social worker. You haven't? No. There's quite a few people have. Yeah, I'm, I'm blessed though. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Because I've heard a lot. Now the RSA is closing down as they are in debt. Older veterans are dying. They're joining the Workermen's Club here in Hamilton. Uh, so there's going to be a subsection of the RSA, Returns Servicemen's Association. So are they closing down around New Zealand, the RSA? You know what I mean? We need, need to honour the vets in our freedoms and our democracies within our society so there's major changes going on there and also we've got another PSA protest the PSA union protest which is happening on the 1st of July uh, 10 Ross Trevor Street recognizing peer support advocacy those who support others now rap is recognizing wellness action plan using hope personal responsibility education what do you think of peer support jenny it's kind of crucial to anything community 
So what do you think of the government cutting back funds to peer support advocacy and recovery? Well, that's just... I know where David Seymour lives. Yeah. That, you know. Are you going to protest <laughs> outside his house <laughs> over this? Yeah. He's taking away the rights of the people, I mean, wellness and health. you're the activist here. I don't know if I'm the activist. Yeah, but you're going to become a wahini who's, who's a, wahine. a warrior, aren't you? You're going to stand up and fight, aren't you, in this battle for your rights? I or don't the know if, if the strategy of screaming outside Seymour's house is going to change <laughs> anything. I think you need to be more strategic. Yeah? Yeah. But we do need to realise that we need our own kaitiaki army, our own home guard. We need to train sovereigns who are self-determined. Now, John, mm -hmm. you know when you talk about self-determination yeah. and uh, kawanatanga, yeah. the right to self-government, yeah. what do you think of that? That's embodied in the treaty. Now, they're saying that the Maori people ceded their sovereignty. What do yeah. you think? Well... The Napui, I spent all my life up there, even though yes. I'm from the East Coast, and I've learned everything about how they think with the most powerful corporation flag in the world. Yeah. The Whakaputanga is what they call it. We call it in Britain the Confederation of the United Tribes. That's yeah. the difference between the two. One is native, the Confederation, and the other is Whakaputanga, Maori. The right. word Maori was created by the Pākehās in the government in Wellington. It's not real. Everything is, like Warren Buffett says, yes. it's a practice or a, a fake crown. Or a, a fake, fake crown. Yep, a yeah. fake crown. Or the story is <laughs> The yeah. king wasn't amused. <laughs> it's the police, it's the yeah. police the politically correct. Yeah, so yeah. Warren Buffett and Manga. The two um, uh, old hands are yeah. saying the 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 um, crown and its money is is a artificial goal. Ah, artificial. Yeah, Fraudulent. artificial it's goal. Yeah, it's right. fake money. Well, we're and being all controlled by fake money. These yeah. are our own opinions. The so, the Federal Reserve, haven't Yeah, that's Federal so, Reserve. When you talk about uh, the heart chakra, yeah. you know, Aroha Nui, yeah. and when you talk about peer support advocacy, yeah. and even the, the Theosophical Society, yeah. free access to spirituality, yeah. now the headquarters up in Auckland is stealing our lodge. Yeah. It's yes. about money oh grubbers yeah. and Freemasonry. Yes, oh that's where I'm at. I'm yeah. right in the middle of this them. This is blooming evil. Yep. This is going society. on. The RSA is shutting down. Yes. The Theosophical Society is That's sealing our lodge in Hamilton. We need to congregate outside David Seymour's house. That is why. We need to challenge these politicians. Yeah. Yeah. So that's, that's what I'm here for, to put the puzzle together with you guys, the realists. You, ah, you are the real you. part realists. of the we're, we're puzzle. Perfect. You are the puzzle that yeah. completes... The story. It is your story, not their history. Yeah. Right. Now, uh, Jeff, I'll bring you in in a minute, but Matariki <coughs> celebrates the midwinter Christmas, the shortest day of the year, uh, where we talk about multiple food source harvest and Pahutakawa. You know, that's where you commit your dead loved ones. You know, that's a star up there at, uh, in the north. Uh, the Bear <coughs> Chief Colt and the Golden Doves. Can you bind the chains of the Pleiades, the arm of our galaxy? Did you know that Mazaroff, all the constellations go uh, right around the Orion? That's where I'm at with the Moai statue on Easter Island. Yes. That's my whakapapa That's there, whakapapa. right there, with the Queen took the Moai statue to England, yes. and she's using it for her title on her lands all over the world. So we're called to ride the chariot throne with God and identify with the lion eagle star. Oh, can I have the lion eagle star? Oh, come on, Jenny, you're a woman, you can give it. Right. <laughs> right, eagle throne. <laughs> I can't. It's painful. So Matariki symbolizes the Benjamin <coughs> Shepherd King Priest Company. There we've got the King Priest. Yeah, the jester stole his crown. That's good, darling. Now, I went to a Matariki celebration, and one Maori guy says, there's no equality, we are at the bottom. The corporate horries, they believe in the trickle-up. That's what Winston Peters said. He said, some of the Maoris, 
that stand for parliament and that, they're going for all the money. Yes. Are they really concerned about their people? Can you tell me that, John? Yes, sure, I'll tell you. There's right. two types of Maori, those yes. in parliament and those outside parliament. Yes. The ones in parliament are the ones that are in partnership yeah. with the Pākehās in the parliament. Yeah. And they are the ones that are using the new company, used to be called Queen and Right of New Zealand. Queen and they right sue of New Zealand. it in the, the sea, and yeah. they've got a new one called Crown Sovereign of New Zealand. Hooray! Now, now I've seen the latest uh, political polls say that um, National's gone up, you know, along with David Seymour, the three Scrooges. Do you think they've gone up in their ratings? I think they may have given <laughs> a media source more money. May have. Yeah. <laughs> I now, don't know if their popularity has... Now, Jeff, you had some spiritual stuff to share with us, didn't well, you? Well, I was actually just going to read out some Bible verse, but we'll yes. leave that for a little minute. I did a Google search, and I yep. looked up 9-11 Inside Job, and the first thing on top was anti-Semitic conspiracies about 9-11 endure 20 years later. Yeah. The October 7th attacks on the illegal state of Israel... Apparently in Mossad. Not the secret intelligence. Yeah, alle involved. allegedly 1,139 people died, 764 civilians, yes. 173 security personnel, and there were 251 hostages. To date, so far, 660 Israeli troops have been killed. I've seen, haven't seen one single image of and or. Was that an inside job by, by the uh, Zionists? In my opinion, I've yet to find the evidence to prove it, but there's evidence that proves Neil Armstrong didn't walk on the moon. All you do is look it up. Don't but men of experts. faith are the sons of Abraham. So there's a wonderful side to Israel. Being that Joseph shall being not Judah. murder, Jack. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We know that, but there's two sides to this equation because Netanyahu is conscripting ultra-Orthodox men, rabbis. Now, they wouldn't want to participate in that battle, would they? Well, one of his lead um, murderers has resigned last week. His name was Benjamin as well. So you've got them dropping away on one side. Naturally, he's going to scratch like turkey. Because I don't believe in those crimes against humanity. And Have you ever heard of a drowning else. rat grasping at straw? Why like can't they leave, you use and I, Hanui in love you and, and understand in God, true right? justice? Yeah. You and I believe in God, right? Yes, we do. Um, Wrong bloodline. Yes. Um, Even Dean, Dean believes in the so, Lord Jesus Christ. Doesn't that mean that the world's going to end so we don't actually have to worry? Yeah, but we're not waiting for Jesus to come on a cloud, Jenny. We've got to get real. When the we, Bible we have to be the change as king priests. That's why I'm wearing this crown. Yeah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We are the true crowd. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Through the Lord of Pains, be the change that you should be. The be. end of these world governments and a new government yes. that comes into place. The, the government of the Lord the Jesus Christ. What? It's yes. the end of these This is what we're, we're yeah. establishing that here today. We're training up the Kaitiaki army. Yeah. We're training up the king priests. We're training up those who know their rights in the Lord Jesus Christ. We're training up crown judicial people who are going to know their rights. Not the fools. Not the idiots who yeah. don't know that they are sovereigns. And how many of them are there out there? 99 out of 100. That's right. <laughs> yes. It's time for them to be educated. Great to be put on a judicial crown. You know? And when they are pressed, they shall not be as the hypocrites are, for they love to pray standing in the synagogues and in the corners yep. of the streets, that they may be seen of men. Verily I say unto you, they have their reward. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so you're talking those... about the synagogue of Satan. You're well, talking about those Jesus those three, three, the they were three, of nine. their father, the devil. Revelation so, 3 9, Jack. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan. Right. Say they are Jews and are not, but do lie. Behold. So you're saying that could be false jury. They Money are men behind the Jews. scenes using upside down Just because some guy puts on a funny world. little hat and bangs his head against a brick wall, it doesn't make <laughs> him a Jew, Jack. That yeah. includes the media who are PC. I've been called a rabbi before, you know, in the Lord Jesus, my heavenly father. James 5, one. Go to now, ye rich men, weep in hell for your miseries that shall come upon you. Okay, down with the black and white rabbit fence. Indigenous rights come to their defense. Freedom, justice, equality for all. Common men unite, heed the call. By cultural liaison officers, universal diplomat ambassadors, peacekeeping activists, freedom fighters, kawana tanga, te kotei tanga, i iwanuku rainbow korowai. 
Yeah, so I'm calling on all the common people. I'm calling on all the Maori people. I'm calling on all people of New Zealand to claim the real crown, not yes. the false crown. Yes. Know yourself as Koti, the Kotiaki army. Know yourself <laughs> as a person endowed with rights by your creator. What do you want to say about this? Self-education. Empower yourself with the knowledge Empower to fight yourself. the system. That's right. And we have the People's Court in Huntley. We'll have a home guard and arresting group, a posse. Because you know, when you stole someone's cattle, what happened to you over in America? Sometimes you were hung. Well, on that course. Nice yeah, but that there's one point there. <laughs> With the hanging, do you realise that that was their food supply? And if someone stole a cow, they'd be st uh, stealing half the farmer's money and revenue. A child it? in England 200 years ago for stealing an apple would be shipped to Australia. Yeah. What? Yep. Yeah. yeah, well, I mean, that's why they had the French Revolution. The peasants are revolting and someone yeah. lose yeah. their heads, you know. And so, on that note, the cattle note, Jack, the planet needs to halve the herd. Yeah. In the next 10 years, we need to get rid of half the cattle. All these farmers, dairy farmers out there, speak to your friends about diversification because Fonterra is going belly up as a direct result of the need. Yeah, but that, the that, planet that's that's saying save the cows from being exported on boats. Save the dogs, but what about saving the men? Wait a minute. Mm. What wait about a minute. saving our families? People still drink dairy? Yeah. They People still not. eat cheese? Yeah. But oh, they're going to like produce like hybrid meat. The of the world cares about it now. I think, I think the government's giving a bit more money to the farmers, though. You know? no. They need no, to really reforest you know, to stop all the water going not into to like, the river. Not to be horrible about like a skill set or anything, schools, but yeah. you know, it's, it is needed, but it's not needed. And a new global government tax is going to bring in a, a global footprint tax. That's why. Right. Yeah, but uh, be uh, I'm money. suspicious of 666, the number of the beast, brother. Yeah. Mm. I, I only believe in the reign of Christ. I only mm. believe in the king priest crowning. And yeah. Revelation now who we are in the Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. What do you think, John? Yeah, I think you're on the button. You're on the cup. Yep, you are on the button. Because I used to belong to Alex Phillips many years ago. Yep. At Manu Ariki. Ariki. Yep. And he gathered all the tribes of the world. He had yep. uh, Aborigines. Yep. He had American tribes. Yep. And he was promoting uh, the Madonna movement. You know, when you identify and solarize mm, yep. the lower tones, you can you can actually see the Donna. Madonna. She brought forth a male child. He's the ruler of the nations for right of iron. And mm. we are part of God's army in these last days. So, But individuals will earn their crowns growing from infants or idiots, gaining their imp independence from corporations, identifying with the royal crown council, judiciary and common law as constitutional marshals. We need more marshal badges. We need to recruit more people into this Kotiaki army. And this uh, Monday, Jenny, you're coming along. They're having the Hamilton West meeting at one o'clock. I so. think I've got custody that day. I need more support. I, know, huh? I yeah. need more of you being to come along. <laughs> okay, wait, no, I don't. It. I just checked my archive. Yeah. And my brain's to call. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. And Bay, Bay Corp is being challenged through cease and desist notices. Rates demand by Andrew <coughs> Hudson. Uh, they, these rates demands are claiming they've got no jurisdiction as they're serving an overseas corporation. Corporations dictate to us bestowing personhood in nautical terms in dock, being in dock, the passport, uh, road seaways. What do you know about this, Dean? Maritime Admiralty Law. The Maritime Admiralty Law. Yep. Okay, and so New Zealand is a uh, violent country. Uh, there should be consequences with ram raiding and hammers used and with the government crackdown on crime. This is going on. They're reintroducing of military training boot camps and the police on the beats, the old Bobby on the beat. I'd like to see a lot more of that. Wouldn't Bandage you? over the problem. Yeah, but will they bring in martial law and will the, the black water come in and take total control? You won't be able to talk to the policeman. We don't, we don't I saw a policeman that. yesterday outside Margaret's no. house. I said, hello, how are you? And he said, we're not here for you, Mr. Gillen. We're here. We're just talking to someone on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> Does he think that you thought that... They were there, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, we have to wisen up and we need to... Honour our the King Priest, the Lord Jesus Christ, and we have to bring in 
the reign of Christ, which is so very important. And don't forget to come along tomorrow to the rates, um, pay as demand of public order outside the council. That will be happening at 11 o'clock tomorrow. Yep. And also on the 1st of July, do come along to the Union Support Advocacy. We're against the Theosophical Society. We believe in free access to spirit, them stealing our lives. Okay, from the fringes for another week, say goodbye, John. Wonderful okay, thank you very much. Anytime I'll be back again. Yeah, we'll have um, you back again yeah. in, in and a week or two. Yeah. Yeah. Get in the word, the sovereignty of the chief is be with you. God bless you all. See you later. Have a fantastic week. <coughs> there we go. <laughs> Today. Um, yeah, I hope you guys. Um, I look really Please, like crazy and out of it. Now you've got a good heart, Jenny. I'm sick. She had parenting no, for sure. Yeah. yeah. I, I found out that it's my heart condition. Yeah. I found out that it actually is. Yeah. Be like, healed in the name of Jesus. Like two days been against ago. against all those conditions. You can be healed. My partner wasn't telling me because he didn't want me you to. Pray.